Welcome back for today's college basketball pick for March 26, 2019. And this one talking about this CIT matchup between Presbyterian and Marshall. And we're going to give our lean on where we see the better value against the spread. The home team Marshall coming in as around four and a half point favorite. So the road team at Presbyterian, they've been solid thus far within the CIT, but we do think that fatigue could catch up to this group at some point, given the fact that this is going to be their third straight true road game. They opened up the CIT with a nice 73-68 to win over Seattle. And then after that, in their last outing, taking down Robert Morris on the road by a final of 77-70. to So this, like I said, is going to be the third straight true road game for Presbyterian. We'll see what they have left in the tank, but also the fact that they're going against an extremely high tempo and high-paced opponent is just another wrench to kind of throw into this for Presbyterian. On the year, this is a group that was in the middle tier of the Big South. They're standing 20-15 and 15 overall. They went 9-7 and seven within Big South play. And Presbyterian, they actually tested themselves against a relatively tough non-conference slate. They went on the road and played some pretty tough opponents, such as the College of Charleston, Marquette, UCLA, Butler, and Dayton. All of these games at Presbyterian fell in. They weren't completely blown out in any of them, but generally falling by between about 10 to 20 points in each of these matches. This is going to be another tough road test for Presbyterian today out of conference, and it could be a little bit tougher than their prior two outings against Seattle and Robert Morris. So Marshall, probably some of you remember last year in the NCAA tournament, Marshall made a little bit of noise, and the fact that they brought back some talent from that team Many thought that Marshall would be a considerable force this year. That just didn't really materialize, though, for the Thundering Herd. They were very inconsistent. At the end of the day, they were able to finish kind of more in that upper tier of Conference USA. They're at 20-14 and 14 overall, and they went 11-7 and 7 within league play. And actually, Marshall played some of their best ball of the season down the stretch run of action in Conference USA when they went on that six-game winning streak, but then they fell short in the Conference USA tournament losing to Southern Miss. On the year, this has been a team that has shown some pretty dangerous numbers on the offensive side of the ball, led by John Elmore, the veteran guard averaging over 20 points per game. Marshall putting up 80 points per game on average in comparison to Presbyterian, who's actually also a more up-tempo type team who's averaging over 78 points per game. But again, the fact that Presbyterian is going into their third straight true road game in the CIT, we have our concerns about that. Marshall, they opened up the CIT with a home win over IUPUI by a final of 78 to 73. We feel like Marshall's going to build off of that positive momentum coming into this one as they go on to win and cover this manageable four and a half point spread. So we're going to start with the home team here, taking Marshall, giving the four and a half points as the better value bet. If you agree, give the video a thumbs up. Disagree, give it a thumbs down. You can check out all of our picks for today's action over at stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we hope to see you guys back here for our next video.